On November 4th, 2022, Drake released the album Her Loss, which was written with 21 Savage. As usual, everyone was interested in the album, and the lyrics were carefully looked over by many people. One line in particular got people talking. There was a line in the song Circo Loco that everyone thought was about the rapper Megan Thee Stallion, which made her angry on Twitter. In today's video, we'll find out the story behind those lyrics and what they mean. Welcome to our channel, Scoop of Gossip your daily dose of gossip. Now, without any more delay, let's jump into the video. These are the lines from Circo Local's lyrics that start the public debate. This bitch lied about getting shot, but she's still a stallion. She don't even get the joke, but she's still smiling. Fans thought that those lines were about the American female rapper Megan Thee Stallion. The lines about being shot refer to a controversial event that happened in July 2020 and got the Canadian rapper Tory Lanez arrested Let's take you back to that night and tell you what happened. Megan Thee Stallion said in public for the first time on August 20th, 2020, that Tory Lane shot her in the foot at a pool party at Kylie Jenner's house on July 12th, 2020. This was the first time she named him or anyone else as her shooter. Megan said in an Instagram Live video that Lane's publicist was trying to spread false information about the shooting that sent her to the hospital and caused her to have surgery. Megan said in the video, yes, Tory shot me. Lanes, whose real name is Dayston Peterson, was arrested for having a hidden gun in a car, but not for allegedly shooting Megan, whose real name is Megan P. Lanes' bail was set at $35,000. It was said that it was hard for the Los Angeles Police Department to find witnesses who could help them with their investigation. Some of the first news stories said that Megan's injuries weren't caused by a gunshot, but by broken glass. Megan admitted in her video that she didn't tell the police what happened. She said she did because she thought the LAPD was aggressive, even though she knows she should have told them right away. Megan said, I didn't get cut by no glass. But let me tell you why they're saying that. When the police came because the neighbors called the police, the police come, I'm scared. All this nonsense with the police. I don't want to die. I didn't want the police to shoot me because there's someone with a gun in the car with me. The investigation took a big step forward on October 8th, 2020, when the Los Angeles District Attorney's Office said that Lanes would be charged with felony assault and gun crimes. The last time Lanes went to court was on April 5, 2022, and things quickly got worse. Reports say that Lanes was handcuffed and put in jail because he broke the rules of his pre-trial release. The trial will start on November 28, 2022. It was supposed to start on September 14, but Lanes' lawyers were busy with another case at the time. Because of a separate incident with August Alizé, Lanes will have to stay at home starting on October 28th. That night, Tory Lanes, whose real name is Dayston Peterson, was arrested for having a hidden gun in his car. Megan Thee Stallion, who had hurt her foot, was also in his car. From what she said that night, it sounds like Glass hurt her. Tory Lanes was later let out on bail for $35,000. But a few days later, Megan Thee Stallion said on her Instagram page that she wasn't hurt by Glass, but by Tory Lanes, who shot her in the foot and caused her to need surgery. According to her public statement, she didn't say it that night because she was scared. Megan was in the car with Tory Lanez and his bodyguard. The police came and questioned everyone, and she didn't want to accuse him directly at the time. Megan Thee Stallion's public statement changed the way the police looked into Tory Lanez. A few months later, he was charged with assault. In November 2022, he will be tried for what happened, and the truth will come out. If fans got Drake's Chico local lyrics right, he seemed to be saying that Megan Thee Stallion lied about being shot that night. Megan Thee Stallion was upset by this, so she tweeted about the line and said that it's not funny to make fun of a joke about someone getting shot. Megan Thee Stallion talked about the debate in three different tweets. Rap is often about putting down other people, and Drake is one of the rappers who doesn't shy away from that possibility. This time, the argument heated up quickly, and you now have all the tools you need to understand it. Okay guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you liked the video, please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.